Hey, welcome back to the table, Bucks Gearbox, and today we're going to be talking about this Vertex Long Walk carry bag. I'm not backpacking, but this is a cool feature, so I wanted to show it to you. Vertex Long Walk Waist Pack. Here we go. hot in here if you enjoyed the video please hit like and subscribe and uh, share it with a buddy it's a fanny pack but of course since it's made by vertex it's not merely a fanny pack it's got some thoughtful uh, designs baked in here and versatility is kind of off the charts let's look at some stats five inches tall ten inches wide and three inches deep there is two liters of space in this bag so it's kind of on the big side of what you'd consider a normal everyday carry fanny pack it only weighs a half a pound uh until you start cramming gear in it and then it weighs a lot more than that because it's big and it can carry a lot of stuff it's got three pockets one pocket up front here got some velcro in there we'll look at that more in depth in a moment uh, it's got a main compartment right here where you can uh put some interesting gear in there it's pretty pretty big this is a it's a big waist pack and then it's got um a back pocket and this back pocket has some interesting features as well as you could see at the beginning of the video I have this thing attached to my backpacking pack and it's really easy to do and this is a pretty strong little piece of fabric here and I think it this might take the place of my chest rig for my backpacking trips in the future let's look at it more in depth all right let's look at the bag a little bit closer in the front you've got a little bit of a pull tag you could stick a carabiner on there and hang something from it if you really wanted to the first pocket, the front pocket, is kind of the small pocket. You can do some admin stuff in here. This is hook and loop material, Velcro back there. Uh, you can fit a pretty good amount of stuff in here. This pocket alone is as big as some of my other fanny packs <laughs> by itself. So that's that's pretty cool. Pretty roomy space. I would use this. I would probably get some of their Tactagami stuff and fit in there and put some pens and organize some gear. Uh, kind of an admin pocket there. This is kind of cool. They've got a grab handle on here that will help you to pick this thing up. Um, you can get it kind of heavy uh, because you can stick a lot of stuff in here. You'll see that throughout the video. Um, and it's kind of nice to have this little grab handle. There's one on the backpack that I use as well if you remember that video. This is the main compartment. Um, all hook and loop material back here on this back wall. Very incredibly roomy space up here. You've got a couple of pockets in here to stuff things in. This thing, it's it's big. It's it's really big. I'll show you how big in a minute. And then back here, you get kind of a uh, rear-facing pocket. It's facing your chest if you carry it with the uh, the chest rig attachments on your backpack, which I will definitely be doing. I've been walking around the house with it like that today. I haven't yet taken on a backpacking trip because I'm a wimp and I don't like getting cold and it's winter now. Uh, but I probably will go and I'll probably take this on a hiking trip with me in the future and I'll try to make a report of that. These are these are just fantastic. This is a really awesome addition to this pack. Kind of a small slim pocket back here, but you can definitely stick. You can stick chapstick and pens and stuff like that back there if you want to. Now to kind of show you how big this thing is, I'm gonna do something a little bit ridiculous. I like peanuts. Um, this is not sponsored video, but I was like, can I fit that in there? Boom, snack and you can fit way more stuff on top of that too now that's ridiculous um i'm not saying i'd never do it but probably not uh, but i do want to show you a bunch of gear that you can stick in here all right here's the bag that is it's pretty full it's pretty tightly packed and I'm just going to show you this explosion of gear that um, you could fit in here. Hypothetically speaking, it is not very super organized or anything like that. This was not like a well thought out um, carry bag um, setup. More of like, I'm just showing you all the crap you can throw in here. Winter time. 
kinds of gadgets, charging cable, pens and knives and flashlights and bug spray and yep, all this stuff. I'm emptying this so I can show you one more thing. Uh, and then I snuck a little notebook and pen back here. Good stuff. Yeah, I mean, carries all that crap. That's a lot of crap. The other thing that I mentioned is uh, it's compatible with the Tactigami stuff from uh, from Vertex and other manufacturers as well. Hook and loop material is going to work in here, and it's great. And you can indeed use this to conceal carry if you would like to. I'm not sure that I'll do that. Um, and, you know, I don't really talk about that much on the channel because I don't feel very qualified to talk about that on the channel, but it is an option. And there you go. This is an awesome pack. All right, let's talk pros and cons, what I like about it. Um, there aren't many cons here because it's a Vertex bag and they make uh, really high quality stuff. No question about that. Uh, one thing to note is you can't carry it cross body, not very easily anyway. It kind of, because it's kind of a bigger pack, it kind of hangs off of your body, so it's not very comfortable. You can kind of tuck it in down here a little bit, but it's probably just honestly not meant for that. It's got these big thick straps. It's prob probably better as a waist pack for sure. The other thing is I kind of wish that for the price, it came with some of the organizing attachments, um, the Tactigami type stuff that Vertex makes. You can put any kind of hook and loop uh, accessory in here and back in here as well. Of course, we kind of talked about that. And I just, it's kind of a little pricey for what it is. It's $65 on the website. But if you go to River's Edge Cutler, you can get it a little bit cheaper. That's where I got mine. The links will be in the description below. I am an affiliate. It'll help out the channel if you make a purchase. Thank you very much if you do that. You don't have to. Obviously the pros are it's high quality. It carries a ton of gear. The straps are these big overbuilt um, kind of heavy duty belt size straps. This will almost certainly become my backpacking chest rig because of the attachment points. It's very cool. Uh, you can customize it with all that hook and loop material. You can really make this your own thing. It's a really well designed and well thought out waste pack and you really can't go wrong with Vertex. They make good stuff. Hope that helps. Hope you enjoyed the video. I'll see you in the next one. Thanks.